Hi, everyone. Today is Mikey and I's first day of school after summer vacation. We missed her so much, didn't we, Mikey? Yes, JJ, it's true. I really miss school. I wonder where they called our teacher. She's been gone for half a lesson. That's right, Mikey. I didn't even notice it. Perhaps the principal has called everyone into an emergency meeting, but for what reason? Hmm, I wonder. If so, that would be great. We haven't gone anywhere in a while, and here comes our teacher. Guys, I come to you with news. We can go on an excursion to the mountains. There will be very interesting, you will be told ancient stories. Show the traditions of the locals, and you can leave your mark on one of the mountains, making a print of your hand with paint. The cost of the excursion is five diamonds. Talk to your parents and those who will go. I am waiting tomorrow at nine o'clock at the bus stop. And do not be late, I ask you. Otherwise, we will leave without you. Guys, class is over. I'll see you tomorrow at nine o'clock. Mikey, you were right. We're going on a field trip. Yes, that's what I thought. It's been so long since we've been anywhere with the class. Let's hurry home and ask mom and dad for 10 diamonds for the field trip. I'm sure. They won't say no. Yeah, you're right. I don't think we'll be turned down this time either. Let's hurry home. They always give us diamonds on our field trips. Yes, I think this time will be no exception. Here we are outside the house. I hope our parents will be home. I think they've already come home from work. Let's hurry up and ask them if they'll let us go on a field trip this time. All right, only this time you ask them, for I asked them last time. So let's go in the house. Dad, Mom, come here. We have something to talk to you about. Is something wrong? Did something happen at school? Did someone hurt you? No, you've got it all wrong. It's fine, but... Just, JJ wanted to tell you that we're having a field trip and we need 10 diamonds for two. Honey, give our kids diamonds for the trip. Okay, boys, here. Take your 10 diamonds for the trip. Wow, thank you so much. Mom, Dad, we love you. You are the best parents in the world. Yes, JJ is telling the truth. You're the best. That's because you're our best kids. Go get some rest. JJ, we have the best parents. They gave us 10 diamonds. Now let's go to our room to rest, for tomorrow will be a long day. Yes, I totally agree with you. We need to get some rest tonight before we go tomorrow. Before we go on rest, we'll need to pack for the trip. Take something we can use. I'll go pack my rucksack too. All right, Mikey, I'll get it all together now. Guys, how do you think our trip's gonna go? Do you go on field trips with your class? Let me know in the comments what you liked best. And I'm gonna go pack. The next day. Kids, did you forget anything at home? No, we got it all. Here we are. Your bus is coming soon. I wish the bus would come soon. Let's go to parents' bus stop. Yeah, let's go to them. Guys, listen carefully to what you're told on the tour. Try to memorize all the information. Okay, Dad, that's what we'll do. And be very careful there and don't stray anywhere from the tour guide. Look, there goes our bus. Finally, I thought we'd been forgotten. Yay, we finally got him. Now, we don't have to worry about not leaving. Boys, be very careful. If something happens, be sure to call us. Do you understand me? Yeah, Mom. Yes, of course. Mom, Dad, we gotta go, bye. Bye, we love you. Mikey, wait for me. What's wrong? Don't you think the parents look a little sad? JJ, they're always like this when we go away. So it's okay, get in your seat, we're leaving. Mom, Dad, we'll miss you. Don't get too upset, we'll be careful. We'll call you when we get there. Okay, son, we'll miss you guys too. Obey your guide and stay close to everyone. We love you, bye. Bye guys, be careful. Mikey, what are you looking forward to on this tour? I don't know. We've never been on one of these tours before, have you? I expect it to be very beautiful there. See the local flora and fauna, and also make new acquaintances. Look, it's the gas station we went to with parents. It's true, I remember her. They used to buy us candy for the road. Right, and I didn't remember that. How long do you think it'll take us to get to our destination? I don't know, JJ, but I hope we don't have long to go. I hope so too. Oh, 
I'm so very tired. I really want to go to sleep now. And so, the pulse is very weak, but it's there. We need to get them to the hospital right away. The sooner the better. Oh no, no way, are we dead? But how? I don't remember anything. What about Mikey? Where is he? JJ, where are we? What happened to us? I don't remember anything. Who are these people? Why don't you explain to me? What's going on here? Mikey, it looks like we've become ghosts. JJ, look, our parents' car is coming. Let's go to them quickly. Maybe they'll see us. Daddy! Mommy, we're here! Can you see us? We're in front of you! Oh no! Our children! How did this happen to them? Comrade Policeman, how did this happen? Can you explain? Of course. Their bus fell off that bridge. The driver probably fell asleep at the wheel. Oh no! Our children! What's wrong with them now? Are they dead? No! Your children are alive! But they're in a very cretinous condition. In what's called a coma. They need to be taken to the hospital and put on a ventilator. What? Are we in a coma? I'm waiting for you at the hospital. I'm going to accompany him to get there faster. No way, I can't believe my eyes. Mikey, we'll have to get to the hospital too. But first, let's try to get a hold of our parents. JJ, I think it's futile, but let's give it a try. Mom, Dad, we're here, can you hear us? Mom, Dad, pay attention to us. We're in front of you, can you see us? Hey, Mikey, stop, they can't hear us or see us. JJ, then we need to get to the hospital. Maybe we can work something out. Okay. Mikey, one thing that makes me happy is that at least we're still alive. Oh, my babies. I still don't believe it. JJ, what do we do now? I don't have any ideas. Dear parents, I have some bad news for you. Your children are in a very serious condition. Doctor, what is their diagnosis? JJ, did you hear that? We are in very bad shape. What should we do? Your children are in a death coma. I'm going to consult with my colleagues and you can pray for them in the meantime. Oh my God, oh no. JJ, what are we gonna do? We're in a death coma. Honey, it's gonna be okay, don't worry. The doctor will figure something out. My boys, I love you so much. Why did this happen to you? Honey, let's pray for them. Mikey, we gotta figure something out. Hmm, oh, I got it. Look, they said something about prayers. God, what if we go to God? and talk to him. Maybe he could help us come back to life. I think it would help, especially since we don't have any other options. Let's go find him. Mikey, are you sure that's gonna help us? JJ, we don't really have any other options, so let's go check it out. So how do we find him? Mikey, do you have any ideas? Hmm. Yeah, I got an idea. Let's go over there. Mikey, are you sure about this? Do you have a better idea? So, my idea is to call out to him until he hears us. Hey, God, if you can hear us, take us to your house. Yes, take us away. Ah! <gasps> Mikey, where are we? Hmm, interesting, interesting. This place is so beautiful and bright. <gasps> JJ, we're where we wanted to be. Wait, what? Look over there, JJ. Wow, they have halos over their heads. Those statues look so noble. Yeah, and they also look weird. Oh, what? Why are they reaching for each other with their hands? These guys are guarding the gate. Mikey doesn't understand anything. What are you saying? Forget it, Mikey. Oh, We're almost to the gate. I am very curious to know what is behind that door. Yeah, I'm curious too. JJ, let's hurry up. Mikey, what's your hurry? Well... Oh, these guys scare me a little bit. Don't worry, JJ. If you haven't done anything wrong, you'll be fine. Oh, I sure hope so. Yay! This place is so special after all. What? Not again. <gasps> I'm a skibbity toilet god of this place. Oh! What are you people doing here? Uh, are you a good god or an evil god? Hmm. Huh, what do you think? Oh my god. JJ, what are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't trust him. Hmm. 
He doesn't look kind at all. Well... No, you're evil! Huh, how did you guess? Uh, look at this, you little boys. Oh my god! Ah, uh, who called me? <gasps> oh, save me. I'm locked in here. Oh! That evil toilet god did this to me. Wow! Please What's the matter, me? Mikey? Well, that's kind of weird. Let's fight him! Yes, I agree with you, but it's weird that god can't free himself. Yes, but we have to help. Yeah, let's do it! There's nothing you can do to me. Attack! Hi no, ah! Yeah, there's no evil god now. Cool. Uh, that was kind of easy. Look, Mikey, are we that strong or was that god that weak? Mm. Did you guys remember me? Oh, that's right, Mikey. Will you release him? Okay, okay. Thank you so much for the rescue. You're welcome. We had to do it. Oh, the fresh air, heavenly skies, beautiful. Yay! In gratitude for my rescue, I'm willing to give you the most precious thing in the world. Whoa, what's that? I don't know, but if it's something from God himself... This must be something cool. I give you a second life. <gasps> oh, my God. Huh, I'm glad you keep mentioning me. Now it's time for you both to go home. Enjoy life and take care of it. Oh my god! Oh, is this a hospital? Hey guys, we did it! We were able to get back to our parents! I'm so glad! We were able to make it back! Hey! Mom! Dad! We're back! Mikey! JJ! We're so glad you're okay. We have been helped by a lovely person back here! You finally come to your senses. We're so glad. We were so worried about you. We missed you so much! Words can't express it! We missed you guys a lot, too. Guys, if you enjoyed today's adventure, then put likes and subscribe to the channel. Yeah, and don't forget to comment and hit the bell so you don't miss out on new adventures.